Updates like this one on the community's radio station are constant, as plane after plane is loaded up with residents from Bonabana Cree Nation and are brought here to Winnipeg for their safety. The Canadian Armed Forces have four Hercules planes dedicated to evacuating over 2,500 people since yesterday afternoon when an out-of-control wildfire got too close. Myrtle Crane and her son Liam were among the first to arrive in the city. 86 people was on that flight, including kids, elders. The fire, 5,700 hectares in size, was just 10 kilometers south of the First Nation, making it hard for many to breathe. Really smoky, dark clouds, even everybody fainting back home. People under evacuation from six First Nations are staying in hotels, mostly in Winnipeg. The Canadian Red Cross is providing evacuees with lodging, food and items like diapers and formula for the children. Kerrigan Wienisk is grateful for the help they've received here in the city. I see the Red Cross. But Wienisk says she's worried for many who are still back home. I'm scared for my grandpa. He was close to the fire. He lives across the lake by himself. He didn't want to come because he has two dogs. <laughs> Yeah, but they said everyone has to leave, everyone has to evacuate, nobody can stay. The Manitoba government says there are currently 71 active wildfires in the province, with the one near Bonabonabi being the most active, as flights continue to bring residents south. T.R. Wheatley, APTN National News, Winnipeg.